Hello there, and as usual, I'm Aaron from Last Day and Gamers, and welcome. So today is Thursday, and Thursday means one thing, we've got an exciting new update from the Space Engineers developers, and you're probably wondering what you'll be getting your hands on in this week's update. Well, let me tell you, it's a lot of rebalancing and a lot of additional features to existing blocks. Say, for instance, the rebalancing of materials, as well as they've added this very nice little tutorial for flight controls and it's the basics of how to fly a ship gives you all the details and you can see how to turn your ship on how to turn it off and really guiding them beginners so they know how to pilot that ship a little bit more safely and it takes you through the level in a very smooth sort of manner and I think these tutorials that they're producing are very professional and they're very sort of easy to understand and follow as you're building through the level but let's actually have a look at some of the other changes now the first thing I want to talk about is thrusters and since I'm here in this tutorial level they actually output more thrust and they're more powerful than they were before but they consume more energy and this is an interesting little factor I'm not 100% sure why they did it because I felt that they were quite balanced before but still it's an extra addition to the game now looking on the other hand we've got a whole variety of blocks that have been reconfigured using different sorts of materials so if we get out of here we go to the G menu you can see that different blocks are now requiring different types of material and in different audience now the whole point of this that they were talking about was to add some sort of progression so you can build things up in more stages and it's not just everything that's delivered to you at a play at once and another feature is that solar panels have been made easy to construct so they work as a very good early starting source of power as long as you keep them in the direct sunlight but let's continue on so now we're moving on to have a look at some of the final changes. The first change I want to talk about is the reactors. The reactors now have a much higher output of energy, but the trade-off for this is they consume uranium a lot faster. I was a little bit confused about that update and why that's a really sort of rebalance. I thought they were fine the way they were. And then what confused me even more was that the armor has been changed. The heavy armor, an armor that I never bothered using anyway because it costs far too many sort of armor blocks, has now been increased even further and has much more protection so it might be viable to use but the amount of steel plates it requires is kind of counterproductive if you ask me in my opinion anyway that's about it for this update there's not too much they've added a few new features on the forum where you can comment and talk about the rebalancing and discuss that there but apart from that that is all we have this week. Anyway, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. And more importantly, I'd really like you to get onto the developers about implementing some more of the mods that are really popular into their game. Anyway, I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.